Hello, I am Tom Watzka, Marketing Manager at Lattice Semiconductor. Today, I'm going to introduce a new IP that is available for the Crosslink family of programmable ASSP video bridging devices, combining the best of both worlds from an FPGA and an ASSP. Before I get into the details of the IP, I'd like to provide a quick overview of the Crosslink device. The Crosslink PASSP is constructed of three basic sections. On the right is a set of two hardened MIPI D5 blocks, each capable of transmitting or receiving up to four lanes at up to 1.5 gigabits per second each. The I.O. sections in the left support a variety of I.O.s, including SLVS, DeFi, and CMOS I.O.s, to name a few. And in the center is an FPGA fabric with a total of 5,900 logic cells, capable of supporting a large variety of protocols, such as MIPI DSI and CSI2. The new IP I will be highlighting today is the MIPI CSI2 to MIPI CSI2 repeater that resides in the Crosslink fabric. Simply put, this IP will accept a CSI2 camera video stream and retransmit that same CSI2 video stream. Here you can see the block diagram that illustrates this, where the IP will accept a CSI2 camera input via the Crosslink DeFi IOs. Once internal to the FPGA fabric, the data stream will be reformatted and transmitted out as CSI2 data. So where can you use the CSI2 to CSI2 repeater? This IP can replicate a low-swing DeFi signal that may have been degraded through prior connectors, flex cables, or long PCB traces in applications such as drones and automotive infotainment systems. Similarly, it can be used to prepare a signal for transmission through connectors, cables, or long PCB traces in automotive infotainment systems and ADAS applications. It can be used to repair or adjust timing on video data or control packets to non-conforming processors. This may be useful in any harsh environments such as drones, automotive, and industrial applications. For more information about Crosslink, visit our website. Thanks for watching.